welcome back to another episode of Opinions with Triggerated and today I am going to be talking to you guys about things that you should never ever <laughs> like ever did you see my emphasis on ever like things you should never say to people in their DM or while on a call with them or people you're talking to for the first time things you should never say to them things that are so ridiculous so um before i go further don't forget to give this video a thumbs up don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section don't forget to subscribe like why should you not subscribe can't you see like this face is telling you please subscribe so definitely don't forget to subscribe to my channel so moving forward as i was saying things that you should never say to people in their dms or while on a call with them so the very first thing for me personally like this is very personal to me if somebody is not close to you if you guys are not like friends or buddies or something and this is very common with your people you jokingly call the person or they or mumu or they means fool mumu means idiot like if we're not close and you call me or they i'll change you for you i'll tell you that you're mad it's not for you because what's that skill of arabic you shouldn't use those words for somebody you're not close with, like somebody that isn't already friends with you. Like imagine me posting something on my Instagram story and we've never chatted, we've never had a conversation, and out of nowhere you just come and say <laughs> love or day. Me or day. Banka shaky. I will swear for you because I know it's not that deep, but we're not friends. You can't talk to me like we're friends. Like no, and it's not even coming from me from, from a place of pride or anything. It just doesn't makes sense it's, okay you come to my dm and you tell me hi okay so after saying hi you just stop there nothing you're not telling me why you're messaging me you're not telling me anything okay so you want to say hi then you want me to say hi back so what if i don't say hi back to you you just stay there with that eye. it means what you want to tell me is not important you don't know what you're doing with your life yet because if it is something important and something that matters to you, you will definitely move forward and tell me, oh, hi, my name is this, um, I got a referral from somebody, somebody, and I just want to tell you that this, 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 can I, are you interested, can I call you, can I, why would you just say hi and stop there, like, it's so ridiculous, I don't know what, I have like 50 eyes in my DM, like, I just look at it and be like, when you are ready, you will tell me what exactly you want to say, because it just doesn't make sense. I call lonely. So here is another thing that people do that is like, oh, it is so annoying. Then, like when you're chatting with a girl, okay, this is mostly common in a guy and a girl conversation. Like we're already chatting, we're you know we're vibing, we're like feeling each other. Then out of nowhere, maybe you say something, and the guy will be like, uh, I hope your boyfriend will not be angry. Just come straight to the point. Do you have a boyfriend? Like. I feel, I feel it is so mature when someone comes out and be like, Oh, do you have a boyfriend? Are you in a relationship? This is not just, aha, I hope your boyfriend will not break my head. I hope, oh, no, 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 that one is common with girls. Girls will be like, ah, I just hope your girlfriend will not break my head if I come to your house. Just ask, do you have a girlfriend? Do you have a boyfriend? What's all that corner, 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 corner thing that you guys like doing? It's so childish and immature. Like just come out straight. Oh, do you have a boyfriend? Oh, I'm I'm sorry if my conversation is um uh, like I'm sorry if I'm having the wrong conversation with you. I hope you don't mind, and I hope you don't have a boyfriend because I wouldn't want to be crossing my boundaries or stepping out of my boundaries or something like that. Like that is way more mature. Why would you say I, I hope your boyfriend will not break my head? It will break your head, and now your head will break in Jesus' name because you have refused to have sense. Common conversation you cannot have. Be chatting like a primary two public. Another thing here is another thing that people do while chatting or while calling that is so annoying. Like God. Okay, let's say um, we're in a relationship of some sort, and you know you be like, yeah, hello. So how are you? How was your day? I miss you. Um, so what are you wearing? See, so let me tell you guys. You don't know this. Even if I am tying a wrapper. Like I'm wearing Iro and Buba complete with Gele. This is what I'm going to tell you. Yeah, I'm wearing that peach color lingerie you bought for me. And I'm just 
I'm just in my room laying on my bed. That is what I'm going to tell you. You think I'm going to tell you I'm dying in Iran, but you think I don't have sense? Because I don't know why. I don't know why you guys ask, what are you wearing? I'm wearing my boo boo. That's what I'm wearing. So get over yourself already. So another thing, another thing that people do that irritates me personally is is those people that felt they are the owner of your phone, like co-owners of that phone. They will just call you at any time. Video call, though, not even audio call. Video call. Like why would you video call me without asking me first if you can call? Do you know maybe I'm in the bathroom? Do you know maybe I'm taking a shit? Do you know maybe I'm not decent enough? Do you know maybe I'm, you know, praying? And you just video call me. What is your aim? What exactly do you want to achieve? Because it doesn't make sense. Because you could just chat the person up like, oh yeah, um, can I call you? I want to video call you. Are you comfortable with that? Can we do that right now? Can I call you? We are not close friends. You're not my family member. Even family members, you should ask us, oh, um, can you talk? Where are you? Can you talk? Not just video call people. It's so rude. So you people should stop that. Because it doesn't make sense. Okay, so another thing, oh my god, another thing that people do that is so annoying is okay, maybe we get to start talking on WhatsApp or something, then you're like, oh, let's exchange pictures. Fun. Two to three pictures are enough. Like, cut it. Once you send three pictures, cut, cut, time out. It's okay. It is enough. But some people, no, because I don't want that this subscription for you, they will send like 50 pictures. What happened? Do you want me to open a separate a separate um, folder for you on my phone? Why? They'll send you different angles where they are sitting, where they are standing, where they... Really? 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 Don't do that. It's, it's not right. It is not right. I don't know what point you're trying to prove, but it is not right. Two to three pictures is just enough. Okay? Okay, here is another thing that people do in um, in the DM that is crazy. Okay, um, I put up a picture, then you come in my DM to say, um, oh yo, what's up? I think I like you. There's no problem. Since you have time to waste, I'll help you waste your time. Since you are still thinking, you are still thinking. My worry, my Continue thinking when you are sure that you like me, I'm sure you say what's on your mind. But since you're still thinking, don't worry, two, three years, I'll still be looking at you, thinking. Then, in this same line of thinking, those that will message you when you post a picture, they'll be like, oh, I think you're pretty. You're, I, 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 I think you're pretty. You think me, I'm pretty. Me, spec, that I know by myself that I'm fine, that I'm beautiful, that I'm pretty. But you, you are still thinking, ah, oh, no problem. Stay there and be thinking. Then some people do something so ridiculous. You post a picture on your page, on Instagram or whatever. You post your picture there. Then instead of them to leave a comment, these people, I believe it, it has to be a mental issue of some sort. Instead of them to leave a comment there like, oh, this picture is nice, I love what you're wearing, I love your makeup, I love your hair or something. Mm -mm. They will now send that picture to you in your DM. Then they will now say, oh, wow, this picture is nice. Auntie, brother, please, why? Why can't you just leave it in the comment section? Oh, it's because you have bad mouthed me somewhere. So you don't want those people to see that comment and ask you why you were leaving a comment on my picture. We know the drill. We get it. We know how it works. Whenever somebody does that to me, I'll be like, oh, so why can't you write this in the comment section? Why are you sending the picture to me in my DM to tell me that, oh, this picture is nice? Go and write it in the comment section. You can't feel it, but feel it. Go and write it in the comment section. <laughs> we know how it works. We know you people. We know your type. Rubbish. This is another thing that people do that I don't understand. I believe this is the 21st century. We should have moved, moved past all those things. Okay, you're, you're chatting with me. You follow me on Instagram or something. I'm using Instagram as an example because that's the app that I use the most. That's the social media app I use the most. Um, then you come and say, oh yeah, I'm this, 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 this. So tell me about yourself. I just hope you know that at that moment, you are telling me to tell you about myself. Even I don't know who I am. I forget. Blank. I go 
black. Like I don't know who I am. Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? I forgot even who I am. Why not just keep on talking to me? We'll talk about different things, music, maybe a particular movie, ask me what I like. Then from there I'll be like, oh no, I don't like doing this, I prefer doing these, these are my hobbies. This. Because I've been I can't I, I, I can't even remember the number of people in this life that I have told about myself. It got to a point I was like, maybe I should just write everything about myself in my notepad. And whenever <laughs> And whenever I, whenever anybody asks me, I'll just go and copy and paste like ba. My friend job by me, me only wrote job. I can't talk too much. Just stay. Because one thing people don't know is when you're chatting with somebody and you're like, oh, tell me about yourself. We are only going to tell you the good things. I'll tell you, oh, my name is Omolo. I came here to I am this. I'm a nursing student. I'm schooling in India. Blah 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 blah. There is no way I would mention that sometimes I used to have that. I'm not going to tell you that. I'm only going to tell you the good things. Oh, I like listening to music. I like hanging out. I love eating out. I love trying out new food. I love. I won't tell you that. Oh, sometimes it used to lose in my head. I'm not going to tell you all of that. So instead of asking people that tell me about yourself, just be like, oh, okay, what do you like doing at your free time? Um, what kind of movies do you like? And you know, from there, the person will also find things to ask you. That's if the person is interested in talking to you. So all that tell me about yourself thing, let's quit doing it because it just doesn't make sense. People just lie to you, actually. I'll just only tell you the good things. I won't tell you the bad things about me because there are two sides to everything and everybody. So tell me about yourself, please. Let's stop it. Let's perish that idea of tell me about yourself, okay? Okay, this one. This one annoys me, like it annoys me. You followed me on Instagram by yourself, by yourself, yeah. Probably after going through my profile, my picture or whatever, you followed me. Then you now come to my DM to tell me to send you my picture. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Don't ask yourself, do you have sense? Because on my page, I have like 20 pictures, I have like 25 different pictures so all that one is not enough for you which picture do you now want me to send you again because we definitely put our best pictures out there so which one with your coconut egg which one did you now do you now want me to send to you again send me a picture who are you that i'll send you a picture i don't understand go and look at the ones on my on my page and if that's not enough for you that's your business i don't care because why would you be saying send me a picture when you when I have like loads of pictures on my page? What are you looking for? Is it new you want me to send you? Or an extra picture of me? Please get out of here. Get out. Okay, so now last but not the least, particularly um like personally, I can't even count the number of times that this has been done to me. You see, there are some people that they've been messaging you over time and then Maybe they are trying to get your attention or something. I don't know. But I, I am very sure that they are not mentally balanced. They have to be sick somehow. Then they will just come and say, Hey, I hope you know you are stupid. I hope you know you are this. Look at your this, this. Like they will now start abusing you, like raining insults on you just to get your attention. Then when you are not like, Oh, wow, why are you talking to me like this? They will not be like, Hey, I just said that to get your attention. I've been trying to chat with you for like two years and you did not reply me. So I just felt like she said that I'm sorry. You are sorry. Is that sorry that will kill you? Because you don't have sense. You don't have sense. Like why would you do that to anybody? If somebody doesn't want to talk to you, then fine. If you have to go to the extent of insulting or raining insults on the person just to get that person's attention, you are the sick person. Like you are very, very, very sick. And I am here to tell you. So guys, that's the end of today's video video if you enjoyed this as much as i do please give this video a thumbs up and of course share this video with all of your friends <laughs> thank you very much please subscribe to my youtube channel i love you guys and i'll see you in my next video bye guys